Oh, what's up, guys? Redcore here. Um, finally back. Had some issues with my computer, but, you know, whatever. Um, yesterday, at the San Diego uh, Comic-Con, the two Wildstar races were revealed, and months ago, we all knew exactly what they were, the Chua and the Zombie Race, of course, because everybody had to ruin that surprise. Um, so the Mordash and the Chua have been released, I guess, um... I guess you can thank your YouTubers for doing all those little, you know, going through all the screenshots and just looking at everything and looking at the original videos and just speculating these last two races. So there it is. That's the whole universe of Wildstar pretty much right there for the races anyways. But now we're going to focus on the, the classes. Uh, a lot of speculation has been done for these next two classes. One has definitely been um, some kind of staff holding um, class. But as we go back, let's see here, let's just start the video right here. Oh, hold on. Healing. In wild there it is. All right, so you, you see that he's got a staff right there, but technically speaking, it's Star an Esper class. Will have to move constantly. Because you can see the little TriStar on the back Evading there. Attacks and and uh, the staff sitting there in the distance. That's definitely an Esper. So it's not really confirmed that the next healing class will be a staff, although that'd be kind of epic. Um, but when you go back to the start of this video, now during development, we'll talk about walking, how to aim, traditional MMO tab targeting, crosshair aiming, crosshair soft targeting, and MOBA style skill shots. Each of these methods has its pros and cons, and attracts some of us oh, more than others. Excuse me. That's In not the end, one I want. We decided Movement, to please. Your details of Wildstar's gameplay mechanics before getting into specifics on classing. Raging, Wildstar, classic I know, but important when okay, you're here trying it is. to say... Coming up right here, line up um, they think that this, the power shot, what he was talking about, it might be the warrior class, but it might be a completely different class. And we're thinking that it's the engineer class, something that uses a rifle, ranged, something... Shot. Heal your butt. Um, Please. That's the Esper right there, a little yellowish flower mobs going. So we don't know exactly what's going on, but it could be a spear class, a staff class. That's the only other weapon that I can see being of use. Um, you got your psychic abilities, your claws, your sword, and your pistols. What else, honestly, can you have coming into the game, coming into the Wildstar universe, um, if it's just as plain as a pistol and a sword, claws, a little bit of a psychic here. That's kind of like normal-ish weapons, I would say, for... Um, this out of a universe. So I think if they're going to go that style of weapons, that kind of plain ish, you know what I'm saying, ish uh, weapon style, that I can only see um, a ranged weapon, such as a rifle for any one of those slots, and a staff for the other one. Um, if we go back to the media, the, the latest video that releases, or that released. The, the new races, um, they have a rifle literally sitting there. Hello, again. Give me one second and I'll show Despite it. Despite my personal feelings on the matter, it seems I will be forced to tell you about them. Now, I don't know what that is, honestly, because that's not a rifle. Uh, that's a rifle. It's not a pistol. It's not a sword. Not an energy claw. It's a rifle. So, I'm guessing... That it's got to be some kind of ranged uh, rifle class, uh, but like the but like the original or the original video, the debut um, had had the had this the giant race for the exiles coming down with a pack of I don't know what you would call it, but like a a pack of weapons. Right here, there it is. Okay, so. So. I'm not sure what they want to. Sorry. Shut up. So, he's got all those weapons that you can use. He's got grenades. Um, I saw. I couldn't find the other video that I was watching where he's just laughing at the sky and shooting off like crazy. So, I don't know if that was. That the warrior can use rifles or not. Um. 
But from the class description, if you click on it, it doesn't say that he can use ranged uh, anything. It just says text sword. So, and the, the spell slinger is just dual pistols, and the esper is a side blade. Um, so claws, obviously. So the next one has to be some kind of rifle using class. And um, judging from the concept art that we saw from the the cast, I forgot how to um, pronounce these guys, but there was a concept art of her with some some kind of staff in her hand and this little blue flame coming up. But you know, that's just speculation. So, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. The next two classes, they might be staff and, um, or the engineer and the medic. They want three tanks, three DPS classes, three healer classes, but obviously every class can do DPS, so we're just going to focus on healing and tanking for now and just make it even. So, well, yeah, two healers so far, two tanks so far, all DPS. It only makes sense to bring another healer and another tank in. So, I mean, I've seen um, a shaman, like such as in World of Warcraft or something like that, that can heal. Maybe they'll bring a shaman-ish type class with a staff, I don't know, or an engineer with a rifle or a tank and the shaman for a healer. We don't know, we don't know, but you know what? They come up with these races very fast. They fit them into the website very easily. Um, as JVAC said, the, the HTML code for the website is meant to be modified. So when they come out with it, it's going to be in everybody's face right away. So, yep, speculation, rifle, tank, um, staff, healer, definitely probably the next two classes to be revealed. Um, that's just my own new guess. It's not NDA. It's not releasing anything that hasn't been said before. Um, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate it.